So I recently spoke at Design Swansea, which is a monthly event that if you haven't been to and you're in the South Wales area, you should definitely go along to. Um, but the, the talk that I gave, I called What the AI? And um, it was just a 10 minute talk. And in, in the talk, I discussed how Iterate are actually using AI um, in the development of new products. And I gave a few examples, but one of those was how we're actually using Viscom to accelerate the, the early part of the design process. So creating new design ideas and concepts and showing how new products could potentially look. And um, a few steps without going into too much detail, but a few steps within that process is that you can actually enter um, quite a light sketch or maybe even a basic 3D CAD model into Viscom. And from that point, it will then um, flesh out many of the details based on a word to visual description. So you enter a description of what the product is, maybe some of the features of the product, and then you complement that with a basic illustration, as I say, with a CAD model or even a sketch. And it will really then turn that into a much more developed product. One of the downsides, particularly of that platform and of AI being used in the design space at the moment, is that it really doesn't um, consider the design for manufacturer aspect of that product. It really doesn't think through the usability and the, the human-centered design aspect of how that product may be used. It's very functional at the moment in that respect. So um, Viscom is a very good tool to play around with and to experiment with. And at the moment, that's how we're using that particular platform um, within Iterate uh, to accelerate the early stage of the design process.